skeleton key here, checking in on my Becca's Bacopolathon status for 2021. And all right, I, I completed nine rolls, but I'm sorry, Brian, my friend pick, walk away. I am not going to get it finished by the end of 2021. So, so I am done with this board. This was a lovely board, but Patience's journey ends on the friend pick square. So this is the board that Becca had for this year's Becca's Bogopolathon in September. And so Atenea, my owl friend, was playing for me there. So she's going to fly away and return for Becca's Bacopolathon next fall. And so now Patience, the cat, is going to start here. And so we will roll and see what we get. Doubles! Ten! All right. So, TBR game. TBR game. Hmm. So that means I need to play a TBR game of some sort. Either my own or somebody else's. Well, I've already done my, my read yourself role for January. So that would be kind of cheating. But I have not done any randomization rolls for my usual rolling up my TBR. So maybe, maybe we'll count one of those for that. But that was doubles, so I roll again. That is seven. Community shelf. A net galley arc. <laughs> I have plenty of those. All right. Um, her last flight. I will finally finish her last flight. Okay. I know what I'm going to do. I have eight titles that I've just been kind of blowing off. These are specific titles that I was supposed to read for either a group read in, in a readathon, you know, or they were somehow assigned, and I just kept putting them off and putting them off. And I just either, and some of them I don't think I even started. So there are eight of those titles. So I'm going to roll a d8. And okay, so number one, Geek Love. Two, Shirley. Three, The Brave. Four, Gothic Tales. Five, The Blood Countess. Six, The Sundial. Seven, The Yellow Bird Sings. And eight, Walk Away. <laughs> So here we go. Well, that was kind of a weird roll, but three is The Brave. And that was a middle grade March group read. And that was actually a prize from Krista at Books and Jams. So that goes on my January reading list for my first Becca's Bacopolathon roll of 2022. Here it is. So to recap, my first two rolls for my 2022 game of Becca's Bacopolathon are The Brave by James Bird and Her Last Flight by Beatrice Williams. And that is also a book club book later this year. And so the way I'm playing the roll-as-you-go version, 
uh, for doubles, I decided that I would do the, the second roll for the double, but then I won't roll again until I've finished both books from both rolls. So hopefully this means that I've got the year off to a good start with the Copplethon. So I'm curious to know if anyone else continues on with Becca's Bacopolithon throughout the year. And if so, did you do that last year and, and how far did you get? Do you do the roll as you go or do you do you do like a monthly TBR based on Bacopoly rolls? Um, yeah, I'm curious to know how other people do that and how you, how you all handle doubles and things like that. Uh, and also let me know if you've read The Brave or Her Last Flight and what you thought of them. In the meantime, please like and subscribe and see you around.